Hey, it's Basher here. I just wanted to show you how to convert a route in Map Source to a track. Many guys ask me how is a quick way to do that. So I'm going to show you what to do here. You want to open up your file that you're working on. And I also open up another Map Source session. And you also need WinGDB3, which you'll see a link on the website here. And I'm going to show you how to make a quick little route and then convert that to a track. I don't use routes just because they've bit me when I've been out in the, on the trail. So I always convert routes to tracks. Um, so here I've got my file opened up. And I will select the route tool. Well, I'm going to select the route tool. There we go. And I'm going to start here, and I'm going to go over to this campground here. So I'm going to let it auto route, and there you see the route it created. And then I'm going to copy this to the clipboard. So I'm going to right click on the file, copy, go to my second map source version, and paste it in. And I see that it's there. I don't really need to look at it. I'm going to save this as a file called convert me. You can name it whatever you want to name, but this is just how I do it. Then you're going to go to win GDB, hit browse, open up your convert me file. And this win GDB utility is very powerful. Click the to clipboard, convert to clipboard button, and make sure you got that selected there and it's already converted go back to your original right click paste you now see that it is there and you can verify it that it is now a track and I go back to routes and delete it from now I have a track and I'll rename it to my standard naming convention that I like to use and since this is an alternate off my main route, I'll just say Alt 2 Campground Paddle Creek. If I can type. There we go. And I also change the color of my alternate routes to blue. I could have done that in the previous one, but I forgot. And there you have it. My route is now a track.